We visit Duart every year for a weekend of 17th century uh, interpretation. There are two scripts we follow that follow the story of Mull and the Maclean family, the Campbell invasion of 1647 and the invasion in 1653 by Oliver Cromwell's Redcoats. That ended sadly for the Redcoats. Their fleet was sunk in a storm just off Duart Point and there are artefacts and an exhibition in the castle about that. Ah, there we are. Ah. I was about to say, you've got that on. Essentially. Yeah. Well, absolutely. You want some water? The 17th century is crucial in the history of Britain and Scotland in particular. Civil wars across England, across Scotland. A wars that started with the Scots King, Charles I, who was King of Scotland and England. Charles went to war with his Scottish subjects, went to war with his English subjects, and that plunged the whole of the British Isles into civil war. Fire! Now, what we do on this weekend is we illustrate the soldiers in Scotland during the 17th century, during those wars. And Mull and the Maclean's were one of the ardent royalist families. They fought for the Stuarts, for Charles I, for Charles II, and they suffered greatly for that. <laughs> The Battle of Inverkeithing, when the English army invaded Fife, the centre of the Scottish line was held by the Maclean's from Mull. They lost five sons that day, each one throwing himself in front of his father to protect his father, the chief, from the English musket balls. And the war cry and the motto you see is another one for Hector, as each son threw himself forward. So the story of Mull, the story of the Maclean's, is key to that part of Scottish history. Where we are at the moment is our living history camp, a camp on the lawns outside Duart Castle, which the visitors walk through and gain an insight into 17th century military life. Oh, apples as well, and I think there's some onions floating around and herbs. But yes, mostly stuff would be collected, and that's how soldiers would get their wages and things would be paid in food. Um, but actually, uh, a lot of stuff was also imported. Fire! It's great fun and I think we enjoy being here and I think the, the visitors, Scottish visitors, English visitors and visitors from all over the world, it enhances hopefully their visit to, to Duart and to Mull.